Yeah, it was a close one. Oh, man. <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> okay, so the NES version, right? Oh. She says that uh, Beijing's been the capital for 800 years. It has not. There were one or two different periods throughout history in that 800 years where it wasn't. I think 800 in itself is just an arbitrary number that they decided on to put in the game. And what do we have now? Oh, we have all three artifacts. Sick. Uh, the NES version. Okay. My biggest complaint, actually, is when you cross a crosswalk, if you're still holding B, you know, the run button, you can't move. You have to let go of B before you hold B again and move. Uh, the graphics, the music, it's... The music for the NES version, don't let it phase you, but it's the biggest country in Asia. That's not true. That's Russia. <laughs> Please. <laughs> They closed the entire Great Wall of China because one brick is missing. Uh, it is the only man-made object visible from outer space. It is not visible from outer space and other man-made objects are visible from outer space and were in 1992 and 3. Oh, damn it. Oh, why can't they just automate whatever, whatever you're looking for? I want to return the stone from the Great Wall. How long is the Great Wall? About how many men did it take to build the Great Wall? So I love when it's the first answer. Ah, <sighs> the Great Wall of China. Uh, the music from the NES version I thought was so drab and boring. It's composed by the same guy who worked on some of the Sims music, The Sims 1 and SimCity 4. SimCity 4 has a stellar soundtrack. I don't know what he worked on for the Sims music, but it wasn't the best part of the Sims soundtrack, so I don't care. But I, I could not believe it. People in the comments were like so excited that this guy did this game is so good. Like really good 8-bit soundtrack. It's not. I didn't think so. I I don't know where people are getting that. But you know to each his own. It's not like it's, it's something I can be like oh that's like it's horrible pop music where it's meaningless or has a negative meaning. And I feel like people actually shouldn't listen to it. Oh my god. The Hall of Good Harvest. I, what it, the Gate of Heavenly Peace fits in Luigi's pocket? The Emperor's New Clothes. <laughs> Who built the Heavenly Gate? Oh, God. Nah. And uh, There's just so many bad things in the NES version. It's so awful. It's so unpleasant. Hmm. But there's only 14 stages in that game. There's 15 in this one. There's seven rooms. And you take a warp pipe and you go into the city. Because there's two warp pipes in each room. Which makes it confusing because there's two warp pipes in each city. And they both lead to Bowser's Castle. So I, I don't... The design is mind-boggling. That Nintendo let this pass. This is the era when people started not trusting Nintendo. Just like in the Vietnam War, people stopped trusting the American government. Even though we did a lot of awful things before then. I... Mm. Uh, oh. No, my God! That's what it said! Oh. Please. Sorry, I'm too busy to talk now. Come back a little later. It also says on Mario Wiki with no citation. A lot of people think this is Princess Daisy, but that is not confirmed. Why is that on the page? Somebody get rid of that, please. It's clearly not Daisy. It is the Peach Sprite from Mario World, and it's not even Peach. Can you know, story-wise, Peach isn't even in this game. She's just hanging out in the Mushroom Kingdom. She probably sent Luigi. Heaven. Oh my God! Please let me in. I, I barely read the options. I'm gonna feel really stupid if it says Forbidden City or whatever. Mm. At least we get to enjoy this music together. Oh my god. The Palace Museum, I remember. Oh, it clicked in my brain. After four tries or whatever. Who built it? Uh, I already did Mao Zedong, right? Is that it? Oh no! No! I just want to return your gate. 
or whatever I'm even returning. Can you blame me for not paying attention? Uh, so, what's been going on in- Oh, yeah, the PC version, uh, I was gonna say, created Ouija. You know, the Ouija sprite? That's an official sprite, uh, released from an official game. It's the- it's from Mario is Missing, the computer versions. And it also has Mario, and, uh, Yoshi, I think, is what they call that Yoshi. And boy, the voice acting is way better than you could imagine in the cartoons. It is hilarious. Oh my god, Mario has two distinct different voices. I... Uh... I mean, it seems like they actually put a small amount of work into the game. So I don't understand why... I don't understand. I'm sorry, I'm really, I'm puzzled by this game. Young Lee, it's not Mao Sutung. Okay, it was Young Lee. Great. I don't want the photo. Uh, yeah, let's get the photo. Come on. It's only once in a lifetime that you go to the Forbidden City. Am I right? You can press select to view the map. How long have you been able to do that? Oh my god. Well, gee whiz. Slap my butter and call me a biscuit. That, that's the whole commentary. That's all it's going to be. No, don't leave yet. Because <laughs> then we'd have to do it all over again after seeing the city is not secure. Get out of here. I will take the Temple of Heaven info. Great, I have absorbed that into my brain. What did the Emperor do here one night a year? Fasted and prayed. Great what hall was built without windows. Oh, sh of course it's air. You know, air conditioning is technically correct. Well, thanks. I'm glad I just got the same information I just told her. Please. Oh my god. My eyes itchy. I'm not having a good time. This is horrible. This is way worse than Donkey Kong Jr. Math, and I am a teacher Super Mario sweater. This. Like, Donkey Kong Jr. Math. It's just math. It's bad because it's math, and it's bad because it wasn't made well. This has nothing going for it at all, except I like the backgrounds a little bit, and uh, the visuals. And I, the controls actually feel pretty decent because they're taken directly from Super Mario World, it feels like. Except, you know, a, little, uh, a good bit worse than that, but they're still... Was it Nails? Architects? Oh, okay, it's Nails. About how high is the Hall of Good Harvest? Uh, fathoms? Feet? Oh, no! Wait, me. That would be miles. Why would that building be a hundred? And I like how if it's, like, supposedly a huge building, it's just this tiny little tur tourist ki kiosk. Oh, my God. We are still in the second city, and we are 20... Five minutes in. <laughs> Fasted and prayed. Nails. Oh my god. Let's get out of this place. I'm out of place. I'm in out of space. I just vanished without a trace. I'm going to a pretty place now where the flowers grow. I'll be back in an hour or so. Mm. Oh, crisp Dazani water. They're just getting much warmer as time goes on. I. So I found out. Um, Something really cool that I'm making more money per hour at Pizza Hut because you know I get paid to go to college than I do at college now. I'm starting to hate college and like my actual Pizza Hut job a lot better than college, so that's kind of depressing me. I've got a semester and less than a half of another semester left, and I just really want to quit. I'm sick of it. I have no free time. I had to skip my nephew's birthday today. Well, I mean, I'm, I am feeling kind of sickly, and I don't want to get him sickly, even though my mom's sickly and is going. But I also just don't want to go and make myself feel worse. I don't know. That makes sense, right? Does that make sense to you guys? Where is this? I wasn't paying attention. Is this Iraq? Is this Africa's East Coast? I know a lot more, but I don't want to boast. All right, cool, dude. Thanks. Africa's East Coast. Uh, you know what? Let's just go for it. Because I'm tired of Luigi's running speed not being the best. Okay, that's not what I want. Africa's east coast. This is that? No, that's Asia. 
Europe and Asia confuse me because they're not separated. It's not Egypt. Is it Ethiopia? Is it Kenya? Is it South Africa? Is it Kenya? I'm gonna go with Kenya. I know Kenya's a city in the game. Oh, it was Kenya! Woohoo! Yeah, a lot of the towns in the game you don't actually go to, they're just kind of filler. Okay, let's turn on that map. I guess we're going down first. Ooh, good move, because we can't go down much. Oh, about to stomp that. Ooh, oh, got stomped. I don't get, are, is everybody hiding because they're scared of the Koopas? I guess that makes sense. But the cop and every, or maybe the warp pipes like just showed up, so the tourists and the cop and everybody are wandering around. Like, kind of like we are, except, you know, just to see and visit. Oh, yep, Kenya. I was right. Third, third largest producer? Why is everybody rhyming? Is that supposed to appeal to the kids? Because it just kind of makes the game more unpleasant. Uh, mm. Oh. Okay. Okay, I guess you don't want the human skull. Fine. Jeez. Oh, that's right. They think Kenya is the place that humanity started. According to this game, at least. Maybe I shouldn't shouldn't read too much into it. Oh my god. What was that? Uh, what is that? Is that a haystack? Is that a haystack turned into a hat? Now that's a cool idea. Ooh, the head, it's a headdress. Okay. Ooh, museum. If you're looking for... Yep. Okay, the human skull was stolen. You had to shut down the whole museum. Oh my god. I mean, because cops are in there, like, inspecting, and they won't leave until they get what they want. I... I don't know. I'm reading way too much into this. But ga this game is technically Mario canon. Uh, there's nothing saying it's not. So if it's not contradicted, it's canon. It is a game, and it's got Mario in it, and the Mario characters, and a story. Very old human fossils. How old is that skull you're holding? Way old. Technically, right? Oh my god. Come on. Let's cheer me up, dude. Where am I? We came through Mombasa and picked our way through lions and elephants to this capital city. The director of the National Museum of Kenya is out of his head with worry over that skull's whereabouts. Thanks, dude. This is a really Kenyan song, isn't it? Very old human fossils. Oh, three million years, that's right. That seems a little ridiculous. Are we really three million years old? You think Christians got upset with this game because it, it tried to... Like, you know, the ones that think we're only like a few thousand years old or whatever. Because the Bible supposedly says that. Even though it doesn't, the Bible could allow for millions upon millions of years. It does not specify whatsoever. I'm not going to be able to do this in one sitting. This game is a slog. So, uh, I talked about how I was really unmotivated in college. Now, that's fun. Let's take a look at our trusty old map. Oh, yeah, there's some Koopas up there. Let's head, let's hop to it. Let's get to it and do it like Sonny Pruitt. Ah, very warm wall. Ooh, artifact. Ooh, no artifact. Oh, we have them both anyway. Alright, I want to return the baby elephant. Okay, no, I think I'll come back later. Okay, that's cool. Let's talk to the cop first. You won't find Adobe here in Morobi, but they do have some spectacular hotels. Good hunting. That's not a sentence I ever want to be told. Good hunting. Animal Preserve. The Safari Park is important because it allows animals to roam free. Wow. Woohoo! I'm an animal rights activist. I don't eat dairy. That makes me an activist, right? Uh, I'm starting to... This game is, I think, what is making me feel sick. I've had two nightmares about this game. I'm just ready to work at Pizza Hut for the rest of my life and make money and have free time because college is working me... Okay, I calculated it. I do about, in this current semester alone, about uh, 30 hours a week 
going to class and doing college stuff. Which, uh, if I divide it all, including the summer, what I make an hour is 10.47 an hour. Which is not bad, but I'm making 10.60 at Pizza Hut. And that really, really upsets me. If that's where the human skull goes, why can't I, wait. Oh, this is closed. Oh my god. Please. Make a living from what animals? Uh, small birds? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not reading any of this nonsense. Mm. Please. And then I, uh, something else happened. I went to my back specialist finally after... I can't even tell you how long, 11 years um, of not going to one. And he was really bending my body around. He was getting the reflex hammer. Anytime he hit me with the like the little joint to reflex hammer, I'd laugh. And, and oh, why did I put collies? Why, I didn't think there were cattle in Kenya. I'm sorry, I'm a dumbass. Somebody at my work didn't know that uh, who was in the Revolutionary War. She thought that the French and the Indians fought Columbus. And that's why we have Mardi Gras. I'm not a debater, but I think it's greater that this African country is split by the equator. That's the sickest line ever. Knock me down with a feather. Oh, cattle. What does a Maasai warrior use to dye his skin red? Ooh, tomato paste. Uh, just kidding, I know it's the thing I don't know, I'm sure. I don't know anything about Kenyan culture. Now I know what... <laughs> <laughs> Why is that guy as tall as that house? <laughs> okay, that's it. City secured. Oh, we got that sick time bonus. <laughs>